The Transport Ministry is in the midst of compiling a detailed report on total losses from airlines and shipping industries due to the haze. Minister Dr. Sri Liu Tong Lai says there is no official figure as of yet, but the losses are very substantial in terms of time and money. Yeah, we are okay. We go. We got good radar system. We got good uh, visibility system to assist uh, our plane to land. Uh, KLIA will be an important airport that we have all the uh, technology that we have. But there are some airports like Langkawi Airport, you know, like Ipoh Airport, our Alor Star Airport, secondary airport. We have, pro we have problem because we don't have uh, a proper what goes, uh, assisted uh, uh, visibility, uh, radar to assist the, the plane to land. Liao told reporters after launching the rebranding of Kojadi Institute to VTAR Institute in Kuala Lumpur on Wednesday. He also says Malaysia wants commitment from Indonesia to address the situation urgently and that the standard operating procedures are already in place to address the worsening haze. We are also concerned respiratory sickness is increasing now. Uh, asthma, number of asthma cases increase, uh, number of uh, chronic disease uh, caused by uh, this pollution also increase. He says all planes will be barred from taking off when visibility levels drop to less than 600 metres, while ships should not sail out when the vision is less than one nautical mile.